was thinking like, wow, why do I vlog? And it's a hard question to ask in this space of me announcing that we're going to take a year off because it almost seems disingenuous. It's like, Shay, why are you not going to vlog? So, yeah, I was just watching that video before and um, I've been watching Shay Carl for, for a little while. Like, he was one of the first vloggers that I ever started watching and he, he kind of inspired me to, you know, do vlogs of my own. You know, I'd watch other vloggers, him, uh, CTFXE, Charles Trippy, um, of course now Casey Neistat. There's a lot of big names in the vlogging game and uh, all of them, they make content in a unique way. And I thought I'd try to jump into that. So, why do I vlog? Well, <laughs> let, let's be real here. I don't really vlog. I don't vlog on the magnitude that these guys vlog. But, you know, I've, I've uploaded a couple in my time. So, yeah, I, like I said, I used to watch all these vloggers back, you know, back before I even had a YouTube channel. And then when I did have a YouTube channel, I continued watching these people. And one day, I got this camera right here, which I'm recording on. I was just like, screw it, Let, you know, let's record. What's the harm in that? And then I recorded my first ever vlog. They stole my camera, which uh, Casey Neistat stole as the video title. Let's go back to when I first started my YouTube channel. I just started a YouTube channel just to make videos. I just wanted to upload a video and I got a pretty decent response. I started with gaming, uh, as you guys know, and I uh, continued going through that. Now my channel's kind of evolved into more of a... I don't know what it's evolved into, but it's definitely different to what it was back in 2000 and 2015, 2014, something like that. Initially, I started a YouTube channel. I, I remember my first video, I said that I wanted to build a community. Well, I wanted a sense of community in my, in my YouTube uh, channel. And I, I think I kind of achieved that, but definitely not to the size that I imagined it back then. Uh, back then I had pretty big dreams, but you know, kind of realizing that it's not, it's not really going to happen that quickly. Uh, you know, deep down, I kind of thought that I could make a career out of this and, you know, I'm not in a position where I can make a career out of my videos like Shay Carl or Casey Neistat or any of those, you know, just really big YouTubers who hustled. I don't know, maybe someday, maybe someday. So after I picked up the camera, recorded my vlogs, got those responses, uh, I realized that it was more than building community. It was about treating uh, my subscribers as individuals, treating them as people who want to come here to be entertained. That's what I got from some of the comments is that you guys somehow liked my videos. I just want to enta entertain whoever visits this channel, whoever comes here and, you know, make their day, make them smile, make them happy, make them want to maybe take an idea from my video, inspire people, you know, just those, those kinds of things. I want to achieve that in a lot of my future videos, which I have, I'm, I'm, I'm like in the middle of planning right now, trust me. So in these up and coming videos, I'm definitely going to, you know, try and improve upon that and try and just to, instead of focusing on building a community or trying to gain more subscribers and likes and views and all that, I just want to make these videos the best that I can so I can entertain, inspire, and make whoever clicks on that video happy. And that's mainly what I want. And I want to make myself happy, make myself content with my content, if that makes kind of any sense at all. And along this journey, I definitely want to be able to uh, expand my outreach and gain a couple new followers or subscribers that enjoy what I do. And you know, I'm just not going to force it anymore because I feel as though before I've tried to force myself to gain subscribers whereas, you know, there's no point, like the content's just not good enough. So this is more of a video of why I make videos or make content or what I'm going to make my content in the future. Like, I, yeah, I definitely need to just look, look back at a couple of things. By the way, a lot of like big YouTubers made videos like this and I wasn't really content. I just felt like I wanted to make a video like this just to look back on and maybe just explain uh, to any of you guys or just make a clear cut on what my purpose is here. I mean, right now there's just really not much to it. I'm just gonna make videos that I'm happy with and hopefully you guys enjoy and are happy with and you can take some sort of message or inspiration from it 
and that's what I'm gonna do. So yeah, that's why I vlog, or that's why I make videos. So in the next couple of weeks, days even, like a week from now, I'm gonna be in Melbourne, so definitely expect uh, vlogs from me there, and in the up and coming future of my channel, expect some better content or just more content in general uh, that you guys will be able to watch. And also if you're a creator yourself, I extend this tag onto you. You know, why do you create videos? Or if you're a viewer, why are you here? Why are you on YouTube? There's a lot of unanswered questions and uh, I'll leave you guys to answer them. All right, well, uh, that's been it for the video uh, and I'll catch you guys next week, hopefully in Melbourne, which will be sick. So yeah, later.